Hey what's going on YouTube welcome back to another brand new video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys what are the best settings for discord to optimize it for gaming how you can utilize discord without making your game lag or stutter fix every single setting in discord so it performs better make sure to watch this video till the end I hope this video helps you out and with all that said let's get started Alright, the very first step is creating a restore point and for that I highly recommend you guys to search for create a restore point on your PC. Once you're here, select your local disk C, simply click on create and name it discord just so you can remember it from. I highly recommend you guys not to skip this step because it is really essential in saving your system's integrity. If you want to restore everything back, you can always do it in one single click. Before moving on, I would like to introduce you all to I, my phone, Magic Mic. A strong real-time AI voice changer that allows you to record, stream and troll among your friends. It has over 225 various AI voice filters and 600 plus voice effects and it is plug and play you don't have to download anything else you can download this for free from the link in the description below and the application looks like this over here you'll find voice box a dedicated voice studio for all of the effects you want to add to your microphone it has a hear myself option to know whatever you are saying and choosing the best effect that fits you and also it has an apply voice filter which you can toggle on or off and as i click on the graceful girl now you guys can hear me in the real time audio processing i think this is really amazing and it's really useful if you are trying to record a video or stream online using a voice modulator the best part is it has male to female, female to male as well as celebrity audio sounds where you can make yourself sound like your favorite celebrities such as Donald Trump, Kylie Jenner, Elon Musk, Taylor Swift and so much more. But this is all for you guys to explore yourself. So check out iMyPhone Magic Mic. Links are in the description below. Next step is opening up your Discord. This is my server by the way. If you want to join it, you will find a link to this down in the description below. Be a part of Fox community we have a thriving community of 44,500 people you can be a part of it too okay so once you are on your discord you have to go to user settings then scroll all the way down to appearance and then the most important part over here is theme if you guys are a discord nitro subscriber just like me you do not have to select any of the themes since since it adds more cpu usage whenever you're using the application i highly recommend you guys sticking with the dark theme since this theme is a least resource consuming and it helps you to run your discord much more smoothly right after that go to accessibility and over here scroll a little bit down until you find reduced motion i highly recommend you guys to turn this thing on this will help you to reduce animations of your discord this will automatically turn off playing gifs whenever your discord is out of focus it also stops playing animated emojis until you hover your mouse over them because discord keeps using your system resources to unnecessarily animate the emojis and gifs which you are not even looking at turning this off will save a lot of resources also for the stickers i highly recommend you guys to keep on animate on interaction but if you are running a really low-end computer keep it on never animate once it is done go down to voice and video and over here scroll all the way down until you find the advanced section you have to turn on video codec the open h264 video codec provided by cisco systems this will help you to accelerate your screen sharing and video settings using hardware acceleration so it will utilize your gpu over your cpu which will keep it free whenever you're playing the games however if you guys face black screen errors you can always turn this thing off to fix that scroll down a bit until you find voice processing and i highly recommend you guys to turn every filters off from here it could be echo cancellation and noise suppression for you guys i highly recommend you guys to turn both of them off since they consume a lot of cpu usage and turning this off will help you to get better performance next you have to go to notifications and then make sure to disable all kinds of notifications for your discord once again you can do this by setting your status to d and d but i highly recommend you guys to turn all of them off because you don't want them to interrupt your gaming session and 
you know minimize your games and that annoying pop-up sound you don't like it so just turn this thing off next is the windows settings and over here you want to set open discord off you don't want discord to boot up with your computer this increases your boot time and we don't want that i highly recommend you guys to open up discord only when you need it and keep it turned off whenever you don't in this way you're gonna save maximum resources on your pc and discord won't interrupt whenever you're playing the games right beneath that you'll find the close button minimize to tray turn this thing on because discord uses a lot of processing power whenever it's turned off and restarted so just turning this thing on so whenever you close discord you can always open it up with the notification bar and it opens up wherever you left it it's really important to do it because it saves a lot of resources but if discord is being an issue whenever playing the games you can always turn it off from the app tray by selecting quit discord next is the advanced section and over here you need to enable two things first one is developer mode and second one is hardware acceleration both of them will help you to optimize the usage of discord and it is really really beneficial to use them however if you're playing cpu intensive games such as valorant you want to turn this thing on and whenever you're playing the gpu intensive games such as fortnite gda 5 i highly recommend you guys to turn this thing off you have to restart your p you have to restart discord once and it will do the changes lastly is the game overlay and for this i highly recommend you guys to turn this thing off game overlay always makes your discord run over the top of your games which will reduce the game priority which will lead to stuttering fps drops lags and so much more simply turning this thing off will keep your game in priority and in focus and discord won't be contributing whenever you're playing the game so you will be saving a lot of system resources whenever you're playing the game once you're done with the best discord settings you can always minimize it and download discord optimization pack i'll be leaving a link to this down in the description below if you guys are facing any issues you can always join my discord server and then look for the fps pack folder where you'll find all of my fps packs in this list once you open this thing up you'll find two simple registries first one is boost pc responsiveness which will help you to reduce input delay caused by discord and next one is the discord priority and pc optimizer batch file this is a compilation of best network settings and cpu priority settings as well as discord priority settings all in one so you don't have to do it manually just running them as administrator will do the task it will automatically apply the best settings and keep your discord optimized once you're done with everything do let me know if this trick helps you out or not in the comment section down below I hope this video helps you out. If it does, make sure to do leave a like and smash the subscribe button. Also, don't forget to check out iMyPhone Magic Mic. It is a really helpful and powerful software if you guys want to stream using a voice changer. We'll see you guys in another amazing video. Until then, stay tuned. Keep watching Bear Fox and peace out.